Hello and welcome back to Baton Kaitos, where today we are here in Opu Village and we've got some things to do. So let's get started doing those things by going into here and seeing the twin shopkeeps who aren't exactly putting their hands on each other's hands. I feel like this would be better if their hands actually touched. Right now it just kind of looks creepy. So we're resting because, yeah. And then we're going to shop. So let's sell some stuff. Sort by price. So the piggy bank is full and we can sell it for a lot of money right now. But if we do, we can't get 100%. So unfortunately, we have to just let it age further. Thankfully, full-on sells for a good amount. Uh, we'll still wait for these to develop further. And that's some cash right there, and these are some money. I mean, I did get some photos. More than I remembered getting, clearly. And there we go. Now to buy things. Ooh, large kebabs. Gonna buy some truffles, even though we've got plenty. And might as well get some fruity gelatin. And a wave blade, and that, and this, and this, and this. And crackers. All right, so now we cross the bridge. Three men, one lady, and a blue grazing. You're looking for a lady, aren't you? We are. Yes. Why? Really strong and amazing, right? Uh, us, yes. How about that? Who are you? Could you speak up? There's a waterfall right next to us that's making lots of noise. How can you know about this? She told me about you. Said she had something to take care of, and that a bunch of people might come while she's gone. She told me to ask you to wait a while. You do know her, don't you? Yeah, probably. Okay, but first, we go into this house to take some stuff. So we examined some red flowers somewhere to get something. Maybe over here. Okay. And then we investigate a thing in the bottom right. So this, no, this. Ooh, yay, we got more uncooked rice. We need to give that to Shella. In fact, we need to make sure that she's got a handful of things. So let's get rid of this mattress and these. Oh, and also this because this is worthless. And also this, because we don't need vinegar. Right now, at least. Alright, so we need her to have that uncooked rice. Uh, uncooked rice? There's the uncooked rice. And we're going to need water. And we're going to want probably another power helmet if we've got one.
Do we have one? We don't have one. Okay, so we've just got the one power helmet. We need to get power helmet, water, and uh, water, fire, and uncooked rice all in the same hand. And hey, fire three. So I guess we'll put in a couple more water ones, I guess. And some fire ones. Just to increase our chances of being able to get those. Because, yeah, then we can make cooked rice, which can be turned into other stuff. Though we have three gameplay hours to do it, because that's how long it takes for uncooked rice to turn into Japanese rice wine. Actually, hang on. We've got stuff to do before going in there. So we walk down the path. And we talk to this person. And now we can go to the church and... I can remember that I need to use the analog stick and not the D-pad for that choice. And we can give some constellations to this guy. Go for it, my man. Yay, a camera too! I'm not certain what use a maple leaf is, but we've got one. So camera two, uh, A has two numbers on it so that it's better for chaining. And B, it takes better photos. So, okay, we've got some levels to give. to probably start using Callus again soonish, But it can wait. Just because he's in last doesn't mean he has to be in the party. So now we go to Mayfi's house and say hello. Do you? That's it? How about you? You got anything to say? No, you're just sitting? Okay, there we go. Sure. When was that? Oh. Is that so?
Are you? Okay. Oh, and apparently there's some curry to get in here. From a pot next to the fireplace. Yay! Freaking love curry. Stuff is delicious. And now we gotta go over here and talk to Mayfi. can get you some cookies. So yeah, we actually do have to go back and buy some cookies of the type that Callus refused to buy earlier. Yeah, how dare you try to do a good deed? What's it to you, kid? Just walks down the bridge to tell us that when he's dressed as a freaking bird? Like we have a choice, Callus. He'd manhandle us again. So now we gotta go all the way back up, and thankfully we don't have to actually go through Hollow Hollow Jungle again. And now we're back in Como Mai. And we need to go get another Celestial Seed from Corellia's room. What's this thing we've got? Ah! It aged. Okay, for reals. Please. Get better at telling me about things, Prophet's Notebook. Another seed. Actually, we need two seeds, I think. Uh, we need to get rid of some stuff. Thankfully, we don't need a pebble. And we can probably also safely get rid of this pressed flower. There's other places where we can get nameless flowers and they can turn into pressed flowers before too long, so... Yeah, we're going to want two seeds, I think. All right. So now that we've got that, we go back outside and we can trade a seed for a cookie. Okay, I, I know what the places are. This is the cookie man. I did.
Oh. Yep, they're so rare you can get an infinite amount of them from Corellia's bedroom. All right. Hey, I got you the seed. There you go. Well, then you were wrong. Hooray. And we should be able to give another seed to someone to get a doll. There you go. And there we go. That doll will be used for a few uh, combos. So that's a thing. But we got to get back to Mayfee because we got the cookies. Yeah. Cookies. Well, that was effective. Wait a minute, you need celestial flowers, which means they have to boom, not boom, bloom. And she wanted to see the bud bloom with her very eyes, but she needs to be healthy before she can see that. But you need it to happen before you can make her healthy. Oh no. Because you vanished from existence earlier. Also, how did you do anything from back there? Also, you told us not to stick our noses in, and then you still did the thing when we finished sticking our noses in to time it perfectly. I guess. Okay. But first. Oh. Yeah. 
But, but yeah, first I want to grab that chest. Let me grab the chest. Let me grab the chest, I said. Okay. It's a level four special for someone. So I'm guessing her hut is this one down here. Looks like it. Uh, is there anything to loot in here? Ceramic containers on the left. Got it. So you came. You saved our hides. You can't just walk away. Thank you again for saving us back there. Don't mention it. It's no big deal. Who are you anyway? Why did you help us? Do you seriously intend to face Gildoblame? I mean, yeah. Yeah. We'll do what we can to thwart their plans. Sounds like you have a death wish. We're not going down that easy, no matter who we're up against. Hmm, could be worse, I guess. Let's go. Huh? Go where? Hey, where are you, me, going? The celestial tree, to see it bloom. What? Why? To get the end magnus. That's what we're here for, isn't it? And how do you know what an end magnus is, hmm? Uh, hey! Wait! Wait up! You haven't even told us your name. My name? It's... Savina. Follow me. Who is she, anyway? I don't know, man. Kind of weird, isn't she? A little bit, yeah. Hmm. Let's follow her. We've got nothing to lose. Or what Liud spent so long thinking about. Alright, well, now that we've got Savina, we should look into some stuff, like... Well, first I'm gonna get out to the world map, because this water wheel is very loud and I don't like it. Don't need that as background noise when I'm setting the party up. So, out we go much better okay so let's reorder things because Savina definitely wants to be in the party because she is very low on XP and we need Shella so that she can make the rice so I guess Gibari's out for a while also Savina's only class 3 so do we have anything oh we do have a thing to equip on her and it is better and he's fully equipped and she's fully equipped and everyone's got everything they need so deck wise how's she doing what's she got she got some gloves and some knuckles and some claws and some other stuff and she's absurdly got a water special and a fire special and a fire special and aqua yell even though it can literally only be used after the crystal mail 
Yeah, let's go ahead and change some things here. And we don't need that, even though it's her best special. Uh, let's go for some attack stuff. Uh, we can get the flame sphere and a couple bombs in there. And that ought to do. Also, she's got both time and wind defense things. So, let's go ahead and swap this out for this. And... Let's actually take one of these bombs away and give her another heat jacket. Just because. And that'll have her be just fine for now. Though, actually, hang on. We want to swap another thing out. Um... Let's get rid of this and give her the camera too. Where is it? There it is. Camera two. And then Liud is fine, I guess. And Shella's got her stuff that she needs. Okay. So I guess now we gotta go to the celestial tree. This is the Celestial Tree. Sure does go up. What a breathtaking sight! This is a huge colony, made up of countless trees growing in symbiosis. I've never seen a colony of this size and vitality. Most colonies would have decayed from the inside, turning into hollow vestiges. The spring in Sadal sued. The cave in Diadem. Here, in Anua Nua, it's the trees. Water. Air. Wood. So, I'm guessing next is fire. What's on your mind, Shella? Oh, it's nothing. Is it really here? Is the third end Magnus around here somewhere? And should we really be talking about this out loud in public? Hey! Hold on, Savina. Where do you think you're going? This area is off limits. Strangers aren't allowed to set foot here. Turn back immediately. So, you're one of the keepers, huh? Of course. Please don't make things difficult. Maybe has caused enough trouble already. Maybe? What's wrong? She seems to have gone up the tree on her own. Oh no. Her grandmother fell sick all of a sudden. Tree vermin have really been worked up lately, which means it's extra dangerous. Not extra dangerous. Climbing the tree without permission is strictly forbidden, even for experienced keepers. She must have gone looking for buds from the Celestial Tree. I've got one in my inventory right now. No! Wait, Sabina. You can't go. Sorry, lady. We're in a bit of a hurry here. I'm sorry. Please excuse us. Her protestations are so effective. We'll find Mayfi for you and bring her back safe and sound. Wait, all of you. Don't say I didn't warn you. Oh, dear. 
All right, but first we actually go in here. And we get that. So now we climb up the left path. And would you look at that? It's a chest, but a also a fight. Battle, okay? Hey, we got a camera right away. Now. Actually need to hold on to fire. Life. Just in case we get the stuff we need to make the rice, but we didn't. She said didn't hurt before it made the actual hitting the shield sound effect. I think you jumped the gun there a little bit, Savina. Ooh, it's the better camera. Okay, so let's go ahead and do eight, seven, six, and then we'll just leave it there. I could have gotten a straight had I gone for it. And here I figured, hey, we'll probably get another eight or something. And if I had just gone for the straight, we would have had it. That was Not that we needed it, but come on. Ooh, and now we can get flame tongues. And these don't stop being on fire after just like an hour, unlike the flame swords. So we can actually start getting fire weaponry for Callus that sticks around. Oh, that seems like a thing that probably classes up Savina. And now we gotta go back down and climb the right path. So, right path, I choose you this time. Thankfully, Callus climbs pretty fast. I've definitely had the displeasure of playing as much slower climbers. Hello, whatever you are. Uh-oh. There she is! Please don't get in our way. Alright, we've got the rice. Now we just need the fire, the water, the helmet. Hey, we got the water. Still gotta get the fire and the helmet, though. Unfortunately, Savina's weapons, much like Liud's, can't be used to block. But they can be used to punch things. I didn't see what was erupting about that. Okay, let's let's just do some damage. Could have made chestnuts, but eh. Fire? Odd. I mean, I guess they are red, but... No, you don't. No, you don't. Okay. 
fishing for fire and for helmets. So that one's almost dead. We need to get a photo of one of these jerks, though. And that's that one down. So time's running out for that photo, at least on this particular fight. I should get the honey out of Liud's inventory. It's no longer keeping pace with our better stuff. Alright, time to use more things. Got the fire, just need the helmet now. Question is, where in her deck is it at this point? So, Savina could use a little bit more health. Let's give it to her. You need this. Use this. Alrighty. So, Shella, let's go ahead and have you heal yourself with some chestnuts and cheese. And then you'll also toss the will. Hey, we got the helmet! So we need to burn another round so that she can make some rice. And hey, we've got a photo camera. A, a camera. It's called a camera. It's not a photo camera, it's just a camera. We can take a photo. Should have had Shelly use the chestnuts on Savina. Get rid of that poison. What are you doing? Carcass of life is an attack increase? Alright, so we got the helmet, we got the rice. We got the water. And we got the fire to cook it. Yeah, we got some rice. We're going to need to make as much of that as we can. Your history. Special attack. Burning arrow. So you'll note that it was her level one special she used to stop Folon from being a jerk. This will be lethal. Looks like it is. And we're going to take the rice unless I see something particularly enticing. All right, we are going to take the rice. Unfortunately, we don't have a fan to cool it with, so we can't do the sushi rice yet. So now we climb up here. And we keep going up because we got to keep going up. I kind of want to fight the things just to get any things they might drop, like more fire swords. Extremely dangerous. Stay alert. Are they extremely dangerous, though? Are they really? Fire I guess I probably shouldn't be using my fire stuff so much on these guys because they use fire so they probably are not weak to it. I haven't been paying attention to what they're weak to. It ain't fire, that's for sure. Okay. 
seven, six, five, three. Oh, we missed the three. I didn't use it in time. Okay, well, this should kill this one. These guys are also pretty quick with their first hit. Didn't hurt. Alrighty. So we've got two pieces of the puzzle to make more ice. Three pieces. Just gotta find the helmet. Go ahead and toss a bomb at it. Oh, she should have plumbed herself. She can do it on her next turn. And this should kill this guy. Having water defense things. No, Got to block all that fire damage. All right, let's take a photo and then toss that. Smile. And then Liud could use a little bit of health, so we'll have him make some chestnuts on himself. though we're probably not taking the chestnuts. And Savina, you need to stop being poisoned and also eat a fish. For you. And why not have some nanners too? For you. And take a photo of yourself. For you. Dang it, if I was faster on the draw, we might have been able to see another thing that could have been the helmet. But hey, at least we've got an attack to use and then a helmet to toss. But not the helmet we want. Good job, Zavina. You've got so much to use. Alright. Let's just do one, two, five. One. Seven. reducing my damage output there. It's fine. We still don't have the helmet. So we're probably not going to get to make any rice against this one. Oh, hey, we paralyzed it. Savina's attacking animations are nice and quick. Quite a thrill, I must say. All right, what do we got? Just a regular photo, but we've got a heat paddle. We want more of those. So we could go down and save Mayfi, but first we're going up again because there's a thing to get here. All right, 
now we go down and we use the save flower just for safety's sake. And also because it's time to end the episode, so that's it for this episode. Join us next time when we rescue Mayfi, probably. See you then, friends. <laughs>